Hello traders, this is Alok Tiwari from Street and I am really excited to share with all of you that we are starting with a new video series where we'll be learning about all the aspects of trading and technical analysis covering stocks, futures, options right from the very basics. In this video today, we are going to learn what is technical analysis, why does it work, how do you benefit from technical analysis and how to backtest a simple trading strategy. So let's get started. Technical analysis sounds like a complicated term, but it's actually quite simple. It is a practice that teaches you to react to market actions. It teaches you to enter into a trade when the time is right and exit when the trade becomes unfavorable, protecting and limiting your losses and letting your winners run. For analysis and to find trading opportunities, traders use various methods such as support and resistance, indicators, patterns and much more. But why should I trust technical analysis, you may ask? Well, let us look at the three important assumptions that form the pillars of technical analysis. The first important assumption is that the market price discounts everything. What does it mean? According to technical analysis, the price action of the instrument already accounts for all the publicly available information that might potentially impact the price, whether it is the market psychology, macroeconomic variables, political actions, fundamentals, etc. Everything is reflected on the charts. For example, if the majority of the market participants are expecting an increase in the net profit of a company by 50% before it announces the results, the market won't react much after the company announces a net profit growth of 50% as it is already factored in the stock price. The second assumption is that the market price moves in trends. When a stock picks up a trading direction, it continues to trade in that direction until and unless there is a shift in trend. This can be understood with supply and demand as well. If there is an increase in the demand, the demand sustains and the uptrend continues unless more supply is created due to any reason. Using the tools of technical analysis, we try to establish which force is overpowering or find out price levels and price patterns that have higher probability of making this shift. If we take an example of the Nifty index, we can clearly see periods of uptrends, downtrends and sideways markets. The third assumption is that history repeats itself. The key to understanding the future lies in the study of the past. This is because the way in which market participants react in a certain situation does not change. For example, people are always very fearful when their position is in loss. People are also highly likely to make mistakes when they are euphoric after a good successful trade. After all, winning a few matches does not mean we have won the tournament, right? We have discussed what technical analysis is and why is it believed to work. But by now, you must have started to think, what exactly am I going to gain by learning technical analysis? The first important thing that you will learn is well-defined entry and exit conditions. One of the good things about technical analysis is that you can create very specific entry and exit rules, taking guesswork out of the equation. Due to this, you also become quick at making trading decisions. The second important thing you will learn is risk management. We all need to be aware that the day we decide to trade, we are accepting to take risks. Risk is the biggest enemy of a trader and technical analysis provides us with weapons to tackle it. For example, the concepts of stop loss and target is an integral part of technical analysis. Every successful trader knows that any trade he executes may bring either profit or loss. A trading system cannot be judged merely by the outcome of a single trade. It is necessary to execute a large number of trades for a strategy to work. Technical analysis teaches you the concept of risk reward, winning rate, probability of setups, etc., which are all very necessary to create a successful trading system. In the last five minutes, we have learned what is technical analysis and i hope you had fun learning that 
Now we'll go to the Streak platform and learn how to create and backtest a simple trading strategy so that you can get started with creating your own strategies. Before creating our sample strategy, let us understand the conditions and theory behind it. We are going to enter a long position whenever the candle crosses above the lower Bollinger Band and exit whenever 10% stop loss is hit or 20% target is achieved. Whenever the price moves below the lower Bollinger Band, it indicates that there has already been an extreme downward movement in the price. And once the price moves back inside the lower Bollinger Band, there is a chance of recovery or reversal. We are going to use the same concept to create our sample strategy. Now, we'll go to the Streak platform and create our strategy. To use the Streak platform, you'll have to visit streak.tech. Once you are on the home page, you'll have to click on the Strategies tab. Then, we'll click on the Create button, give it a name, and then we'll click on the Create button. First of all, we'll have to add an instrument to our strategy. We'll click on the Add button. I'm going to go with Nifty 50. You can add any stocks as per your preference. Now, I'll click on the Done button. In the quantity, I'm going to pick 5. You can pick any quantity as per your preference. Please note that this strategy is only for educational purpose and should not be construed as trading or investment advice. In the position, I'm going to go with buy. Now I can start creating my entry conditions. I want to go long whenever the close price crosses above the lower Bollinger Band. Now I'm going to create the exit conditions. I want to exit if 10% stop loss is hit or 20% target is achieved. In the backtest parameters, I'll click on the pencil icon and change the holding type to CNC and RML. Click on save changes. Finally, I'll scroll up and change the candle interval to daily time frame. Now, I'm ready to click on the save and backtest button so that I can run the strategy on historical data to check its performance. I'll click here. Now the backtest has started running. I've got the results also over here. To do in-depth analysis, we can click on the result over here. Here you can see each and every trade that has taken place during the backtest period in a table as well as in a chart form over here. Once you are ready and satisfied with the results, you can pick the stocks that you would want to trade and then click on the deploy button. Here we have provided two options. You can either go for paper trading or live trading. In the paper trading mode, trading happens using virtual capital. It allows you to test your strategy in the live market without risking your real money. Once you are satisfied, you may opt for live trade. After accepting the terms, I can click on the live trade button to deploy my strategy in the live market. Thank you for staying with us towards the end of this webinar. I hope you had a great learning experience. If you have any doubts, do write to me and let me know in the comments. I'll make sure to reply to each one of you. Please like the video and subscribe to our channel so that you do not miss our future videos. See you in the next one.